Hand-painted models can create a unique and creative style for a game. This video will not cover specific techniques or how to achieve particular results. However, in this video, we'll be taking a quick look at how to set up an object to be hand-painted in Blender. For this tutorial, we'll be painting a simple cube to demonstrate the process. First, open a second window and select the UV image editor in the menu below. This will allow us to see the unwrapping and the progress of the painting. Select the cube and press tab to enter edit mode. Make sure all faces are selected. Then in the mesh menu at the bottom of the window, select UV unwrap and then smart UV project. This will bring up a menu with new options. The default settings are good enough for what we're doing. You should now see the unwrap shape in the image editor. The next step is to change the texture paint mode. At the top left, you'll see a warning of missing data. Click on the drop down menu labeled add paint slot and choose diffuse color. This will bring up the option to create a new texture. You can rename the texture and change its size depending on your needs. In the UV image editor, select the newly created image. With the setup, you can now paint the model using the mouse cursor. You can select any color and select several different paint methods. As you paint, you can see the color show up in the UV image editor as well. Occasionally, it can be easier to paint in the UV image editor itself. In the bottom right of the UV image editor window, change the mode from view to paint, and you'll then be able to paint on the image itself. To export your hand-painted model, you will need to export both the model as an FBX, as well as a PNG texture. Both can then be imported into Unity, where the PNG texture should be placed in the albedo slot of the material. If you want to learn more about hand painting techniques, check out the links in the description below.